the buy and hold concept. And I remember she said, uh, I, I asked her, how did you do this? How did you accumulate wealth? You see, because she was talking about the duplex that she lived in. And then the next year she had bought another one. And she told me the people on the other side were paying enough money to cover the mortgage and the other money from the other side of the duplex was their money and they got to live a pretty nice lifestyle. They went out, Aunt Mabel didn't like to cook. <laughs> and so they went out every night to the steakhouse and they had what I would consider to be a pretty good life. So uh, I looked at it and then they acquired another one and another one and another one. And then I got a call from Aunt Mabel and she says, come on over here and help me move. I said, move where? She said, a brand new house and a brand new subdivision, all brick home on a corner lot. And I said, how did you do this Aunt Mabel? And she said two words. She said, accumulate property. And that was a, a impact for the rest of my life because it, what it really said is do something today that pays you forever. And that's something I see that wealthy people do. They invest their time into a business or a strategy or an asset that then produces income for them forever. So that's my advice. Number one.